With regards to my um, so-called reactions towards the vaccinations for COVID, now, give, despite the side effects, I believe the benefits outweigh the side effects, but this is my experience uh, with, with it. Uh, with the first dose, I remember having a uh, very low-grade fever. Um, this is taking into account that my um, base body temperature is probably lower than other people. Um, so when I get up to about 37.2, 37.3, and it's possibly climbing like my doctor said, I, I start to feel unwell. Um, I had body ache, of course, chills, um, and a very bad fatigue for the first dose that lasted about four weeks. And then one morning, I just got up, ding, ding, it, it turned the corner, and I knew that it was over and done with. Now, there came the second dose. Um, the second dose, I, if I'm not mistaken, I had a, a fever, a, a very noticeable fever. So, again, keeping in mind that my body temperature is, you know, probably lower than other people, um, so to have something close to 38, um, I, I feel very, very unwell. But um, the second dose, I did not have a prolonged uh, season of fatigue. Uh, once the fever was over and done with, I slowly got better and felt better. The third one, uh, I've just had the booster. I just had uh, a very severe body ache. Uh, no fever that I remember, but I went into the GP because I could barely walk. My, my whole body was aching and paining and joints hurt like hell. Uh, that one lasted maybe like two days. And unfortunately, the, where fatigue is concerned, um, two weeks later, I'm still very, very tired. And it looks like it's going the same pattern as the first dose. But Given the overall um, pros and cons, yes, I would take the vaccination even so. And um, I will still continue to take whatever it, they give me because I believe that, in my own way, I believe that this uh, actually trains my immune system to fight against COVID should I ever get it. And I hope not. I work in a very exposed occupation. So, uh, yeah, any any sort of training system for my immune, you know, training for my immune system, is going to be more than welcome. But this is my what I feel, and you don't have to agree with me. But I would very strongly encourage you, if you are able to, and if you are medically able to, to take the vaccination. God bless you. Keep safe.